A giant Splunkette. I'm sure that won't work against me. <laughs> so I have, I'm relatively easy to kill, but I'm massive and stuff or something. Uh, how much money do I have? I, uh, don't remember. Crap. So mana up would be good or get more equip up. I should get more equip up just so I can carry more stuff. I don't have much crit up either. It's really hard to make up your mind on what to buy because there's so many freaking options. I could just increase my... Let's do increase... No, let's do equip load. Just so I can put better stuff on. Yeah, I'm a giant Spelunket. All right. So what can I have? Can I get something cooler now? I already have the Sage Helm on. What do I have over here? This one would give me more armor. And I could wear it. Blammo, look at me having more armor and shit and maximum equip load. Now let's just see how fast I can die being freaking massive. So I got a new rune in here somewhere. There it is. Multiple rune stack for longer flight duration. I don't... I'm not super into the idea of flying. That just sounds like it could go poorly for me. Oh wait. I have 798 gold I need to spend. So you can buy that? Nope. Nope. Alright. I need to, I definitely need to pick something to spend it on because I'm not... I don't exactly get to keep it all. Let's see, that one gives me plus to all sorts of things. Oh wait, no, this is the slot where I'm getting the gold bonus from. What about these things? Yeah, that give me those would give me more magic. So let's buy those. I can't wear them yet until I get better equip load again. But at least I have them, and so I only am blowing a little bit of money instead of 700 gold. That was almost a big fuck up on my part. Whoops. Gotta pay attention to what I'm doing. It's so satisfying to be a giant with a ridiculously large sword. And immediately, here's a room out where it's difficult to get around by being, while being a giant. This game is here to taunt me. Son of a bitch. There we go. Just gotta use proper dashing. Jesus Christ, why is everything hard now? <laughs> Someone suggested that the game scales based on your level, and I guess that must be true, because... God damn, this game does not want me... Uh, really? The fireballs? I'm almost dead in the first room. This game got astronomically harder very suddenly. What the hell? I get the feeling that it's not a very gradual scaling. Like, you basically just hit a specific level, and suddenly it's like, Alright, time for hard mode. Yeah, I'm gonna die in this room. I am going to die in this room. Holy crap. This was a... This is already a bad idea. Giant Spelunket, no good. <laughs> Being the guy that's bad at combat, but also giant and easy to hit. Terrible move. Jesus Christ. Maybe I'll just get a bunch of... Maybe I'll get lucky and get some freaking money lying around. I'm afraid to jump around because I feel like I'm going to get hit by a... I feel like I'm going to hurt myself. Just at random. Oh, it's the portal of randomness. That sounds... Ah, uh, fuck it. Let's just try it. What can go wrong, right? Underworld, right? You're going to immediately throw me... Nope, not the underworld. Thank God. Oh, God. You almost killed me immediately with that spell. This is a room full of magic casters. Are you serious? Holy shit. This game got hard like overnight. Why you gotta do this to me? Yeah, giants are bad. Immediately, here's a giant barbarian king. That'd be a lot of hit points for sure. A bald barbarian king. Paladin, colorblind, permaroided. Fuck it, giant barbarian king, even though I just said I don't want to play as a giant. Let's just go ahead and just contradict myself immediately. Can't really afford anything right now, can I? I did so poorly because of how just bad things were immediately that I don't think I can even afford to buy a single thing here. Nope, cheapest thing is like 900 gold. Well, <laughs> let's see if I can buy, a piece, buy a piece of equipment that I probably won't use. Just so I have it. 850. Can't even afford this cloak. Wait, this cloak doesn't do anything. Oh, plus one siphon. I was going to say, like, why does this thing do plus 20... Wait, and not do actually accomplish anything. Does this one also have... No, that one doesn't have, doesn't have Siphon. Okay. Uh... Buy a helmet, I guess? Why the fuck not? Buying helmets doesn't make the other ones cost more, does it? I know... I think... Oop. My bad. I think buying runes makes the runes more expensive, but I don't think buying helmets makes them more expensive. If I can just get a lot of hit points and a lot of life drain, I could probably keep myself going. I need some level of... Self, uh, s uh... What am I trying to say? Self-perpetuation? <laughs> Self-preservation? There we go, that's a better word. Freaking every- everything in this room is death! 
Wow, I have a- my head's not real. Ah! Jesus- Oh god! You're attacking the platform I'm standing on. Everything's bad. I don't like it. <laughs> Jesus, the difficulty spiked right out of the freaking park, didn't it? It's severe- it's just generally hazardous to be alive right now. Oh, hi, carnival asshole. How you doing? Hi there! Let's see how great are your skills, something something. Uh, because we've already talked to this guy too many times. Yep, here's... Here we go. Alright. I always fuck this up. I don't really have much of a strategy. Eh, jump attack? Jump throw! I got a lot of them. Oh. Yep. 15 left. I keep getting closer and closer, but... Getting down to only 10 left. That's... I, at some point, I probably should just look up a guide. And just see how someone did it, because... It seems like there's probably a pretty specific method for that. Oh god, there's just death projectiles everywhere! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Anything else? Just portraits and shit? Okay. Just gotta get me- gotta make some bank! <laughs> Come- <laughs> How do I- I want it! I want it! If you're tiny, you can probably go through the hole here. At least that's my working explanation of that situation. Already- already another journal! Alright, we're getting a lot of these. Journal entry number 14. I have been methodically clearing the demons in this in these rooms in my quest to slay the next guardian, but I'm losing track of time and other things. As I entered the tower, I felt time stand still. Or perhaps there is the vertigo or perhaps that is the vertigo talking? I was never keen on heights. Or was I? I am finding it increasingly difficult to remember my past. Uh-oh. Is it because you're being reborn over and over again? And you're actually not the same person you came in here as? What? Oh god, no. I'll go to a number of different locations for the sake of trying to make progress. The underworld, not that one. That seems to be specifically the one that's not a great place to be. Ever. I'm a motherfucking barbarian king! Double kill, bitch! <laughs> it's actually working out for me. Uh, ah! Just giant Spelunket was a terrible idea. Because Spelunkers aren't good at combat. And don't really have particular hit points, so it's like your own... Any, anything, anything you're getting good from be- Ow! I meant to jump to the floor. Okay. Anything good coming from being a giant is pretty much undone by being a spelunker. Aside from the extra reach. Gotta run across. Uh, there we go. See, it's the sad thing is I'm playing as a character. I'm playing as the Barbarian King instead of a spelunker. And I already have more hit points now than I ever did. I mean, I already have more money than I did as a spelunker. General entry number 15. I remember being a famous adventurer. My martial prowess surpassed all of my brothers, that I am sure of. While they spent their days buried in bookish studies, I was out killing brigands and monsters. I always wondered why my father favored them over me? It isn't... Isn't it always the opposite in fairy tales? Fortune favors the bold, not the insipid and like intellectual or something like that. Man, I, I would love to see my brothers try to think my sword out of their face. Oh, sorry. I'm, I'm thinking said. I, th I probably misread that. It's probably supposed to say, uh, "Man, I would. I'd like to see my brothers. Th uh, what my brothers think of my sword in their face." Is probably what he what, is, what it said. But I misread it because that sentence I said did not really comprehend. A uh, ah, son of a bitch. They give you the tiniest platforms to stand on. Okay, this game is getting scary. Jesus. I wonder, like, how if I I, I almost want to see like. A, a, like a, a, uh, a guide on how to beat the game like not a walkthrough, but just like here's tips on what you're supposed to do And like what if the what if one of the tips is like oh for the love of God don't level up because or only level specific things Because your overall levels determined because uh, when I think about it, your overall your overall levels is determined by all the things you pick up I can't go in here. Can I No. Your overall level is determined by what items, I mean, what, how, how, like, how many overall upgrades you have. Even random ones you don't really use, like unlocking classes that you turn out to not like and stuff like that. And so, uh, as you level up in general, the, the game might just level up in response to that. And if you have unfocused leveling and you're leveling things that you don't really use, that actually means that the levels, the game may be getting tougher faster than you're getting tougher. Could be totally a thing. I sure know I'm spending a lot of time in this castle instead of the, uh, j j Oh crap, there's also death walls in this area. Okay, at least there's a freaking... God damn it, I can't... There's eyeballs, which means I can't even stand on top of something to avoid the fireballs. I need... I need... I need... 
Get out! Get out of here! Get out! Shit. Ugh. So many things trying to kill me at once. I'm surprised they didn't just pile on by making all of those freaking uh, paintings come to life while I was here. It's like, yeah, on top of dealing with the, the projectiles, mage guys, and the multiple melee people on the ground, and the fire coming out of the wall, and the eyeball, there's also... Oh wow, that one th didn't line up. Like, if, uh, just on top of that, all the paintings you walked by attacked you. I'm so used to those things exploding, but it actually... I'm used to those projectiles being safe when you're not on the right uh, level, but... I was up on the platform and I actually got hit by it. That's annoying. Ah! That's like that, that's my single least favorite enemy in the entire game, I think, is the guys that shoot fireballs at you. Because they are very frustrating. Especially later when they start shooting the fireballs just way faster. Because they just like, hey, you want to have 50,000 projectiles to deal with? No, I don't, because you probably have friends and they're throwing things too. Hey, look, it's the guy I was just talking about hating. They're everywhere. Good for you. And there's immediately multiple of them, as I was saying that they tend to gang up on you while there's multiple enemies around. This game just, it knows me. It knows everything I don't like dealing with and just throws it all at me. The game probably measures. I would I would not be surprised if the game was actually like kept track of what kills you and is like, alright, we'll just put more of those in there. <laughs> He's such a dick move. You can't get rid of me, there's a wall behind me. Haha, <laughs> also I'm bigger than you apparently. It makes you a little less intimidating. Being a giant barbarian king seems to be working out for me right now. As per a, uh, co a commenter said pro probably would happen. This may be the way to go. It's just too bad the game's completely random, so you can't really be like, Alright, here's my ideal strategy. I'll just stick to that one for a while. I'm not fighting anyone in this room. Fuck it. There's spikes on every floor. I'm at it. I'm at it. You fucking attack- Oh, there was a slime. I was like, how did his spire spell come out so fast? Like, did he lead me? Like, did he aim it ahead of me? I've never seen them do that, but th there was a tiny slime that I didn't even see until afterwards. Please be a real chest? Yeah. Now oh, I have to go back through the same room! Why you gotta do this to me, forest? What kind of forest is this that's just like a bunch of floating rocks? Oh! I, I uh... I trap. Oh, motherfucker! Get from that! I'm out of here. I'm out of here. 5,000. Ah, get out of here. Okay, bye. I'm never going in that room again. And I don't have to because it was a dead end. Hooray. Yeah, being barbarian bar 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 king seems to work out for me. If only I could get more life drain so I can so efficiently heal back. Oh, look. It's this asshole. Hi, greetings, adventure. I like to, you like to gamble? I like to gamble, gamble, gamble. Okay, fuck it. Uh, p -p 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 the right one. What's in the box? Nothing! You stupid, so stupid. Okay, fine. Bye. That guy's an asshole. One of these days I'll win from him. <laughs> uh, I read someone break down the math. I th at least I think I did at some point. And I think they confirmed that, like, based on just basic uh, chance, you're actually more like, you're most likely going to have a net gain if you gamble every time you encounter that guy because I, I think I think they found that the, like the the uh, the reward for winning out actually does outweigh your chances of losing basically so it's actually it's a smart gamble to do is what it sounded like but either way gold is just a resource you just get spammed with everywhere so if I blow a little bit of it on up on something like that I'll yeah I'll take it and I'll just hope that something good works out all right I don't bounce high enough to hit the ceiling that was my concern, is that I thought I might hit the, uh, tall guard, and I might bounce up and hit the freaking... ...roof. More money! Yeah, 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 yeah! I should be dashing more. That dash actually is... You can definitely spam it. So you can get around for- Ow! Motherfucker, just... You're a mage! Hit me with spells! And he's like, I'm gonna hit you with my head! Ha <laughs> ha! My head's dangerous, too. That's always the... ...thing about these... Video, these types of video games, like, just making physical contact of any form is like getting, like, triple AIDS, cancer, nuclear poisoning. <laughs> they somehow just completely devastate you, but with their skin. I... <laughs> New fast-acting leprosy. Uh, I missed. I'll so oh, Jesus, there's spikes here, too. I, didn't, I somehow just completely failed to not notice that specific set of spikes. Uh, okay. Do I, let's, okay, there's, there's fireballs up there, so let's go down instead. Bye! That's the- that's that guy. Okay. I can dash past him, though. Yes, I can. I'm not- I'm not gonna deal with that in spike room. That seems like a terrible idea. 
What is the pattern here? Okay. Okay, I get it. This is easy. Do, 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 do. There we go. Ah, mother! Okay, yeah, right. The last one's... I didn't think about that, but on the far end, it's gonna... It starts up immediately, so you're likely to get hit. So I found the boss chamber. Did it give me lots of food? Kind of. Some food. Let's try the next room. Okay. What's going on in there? There's a chest and a giant mage of some kind. Oh, he does that, right. Okay. No, oh, this, this isn't too bad to deal with then. Ow! I walked into the spikes? Are you serious? I did that? Wow. Just... I should just quit video games forever. What, why even bother? I'm so ama amazingly terrible at them. Alright, over 4K is not a terrible haul. I guess I'll just... I'll give the boss a shot! Alright, this, this is the giant uh, skeleton guy that shoots around. If I remember correctly, this is the guy that's like... He's actually... He seemed doable to me from last time I saw him, because his main attack's really dodgeable. You just don't want to be on the same plane as him. The biggest scary thing is the fact that he l keeps summoning more skeletons. That's potentially dangerous. Am I... Uh, okay, I'm above him. Ah! The skeletons are becoming a problem! Ah, uh, so I can Fusro Da the uh, skeletons away a bit. That's good. But, uh, oh uh, crap, right. Fusro Da costs mana. So by... Uh, oh god. So, so I accidentally... Oh god, I'm trapped. Okay. Ah, gotta get out. Haha. <laughs> Leave me alone. Oh yeah, the, the skeleton... All these little skeletons actually heal me. I didn't think about that. So if I keep killing the skeletons, I'll get ow, hit points, and man up. Ow! They're, they're killing me faster than I'm killing them. They're, they're killing me faster than... Oh god, oh god. They're trapping me between projectiles now. Huh. Okay. This is this might be bad. Uh, motherfucker, they're everywhere. No, get out. Bad. Huh. I'm screwed. I was not okay, I did not stay on top of skeleton duty, clearly. Huh, I feel like I can do that boss. It's just I need better skeleton clearing powers. Jesus. Oh look at a little tiny guy. I'm never playing as a tiny a dwarf again. You are gay, a clumsy gay shinobi. Okay. So being a being a clumsy shinobi seems like a terrible idea. An assassin that gets freaked out by chickens. Chickens freak you out. Electrophobia. Don't you eat chicken to eat to heal in this game? How's that work? That's that's concerning. Huh. Whatever, I'll do it. My special is a mist form. Okay. I like mist. Sierra mist. <laughs> this video brought to you by Pepsi. Uh, that doesn't even make sense. Uh, more equip load? I could do more equip load just to have a better set of everything. There's always so many options. I'm so bad at this. Okay, so you'll do equip load and we'll do damage. There we go. Because I knew that if I, if I increase my equip load by about 20, I'll be able to put on these better pauldrons over here that give me six more magic. Yeah! Then more or less, let's see, what was, was there, there was like a $500 thing here, right? That I could, that I, could, I could buy? Nope, that's what I bought last time, so I'm probably gonna throw my money away now, unfortunately. Oh well. It happens. Everything just costs so much at this point in the game that you're just gonna blow money. It's the, it, everything costs approximately $1,000 now, so if you have less than $1,000 left over after a, a run, that's just it for you. So now I'm an assassin, so my ability is that I can- Ah! Uh, so I can do mist form, so woo! So what does that do? Well, I guess I'll just have to learn on the fly. Get out of here. Why is it- Everything seems so calm now. I feel like we're getting obliterated earlier, but now the castle seems like it's taking it easy on me. Hey bro, out of here. Woo! Does mist mean I can jump through here? Does not, okay. Was the, does the mist form make me unhurtable? Maybe? I'm afraid to test that. Ugh. Well, I'm certainly out of mana, unfortunately, so that was a bad move. Uh, I'm gonna get out of here, because this place won't let me get around. This motherfucker! I didn't- Ah! God fucking- The second fireball throws me off so hard. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Oh, because I'd watch the one on the left and find the perfect opening, and then... 
Of course, that'd be the exact moment when the second one would attack me. So, right, so eating that chicken leg didn't seem to do anything to me. Is there a chicken in this game? Or is electrophobia just one of those random traits that's like, sort of like you are gay, where it's just like this, or baldness, where it's like kind of not going to affect it. Oh, those go through walls. Those go, okay. No likey, let's kill these extras real quick. Motherfucker. You are basically the worst thing, I don't just hope you know that. <laughs> Plonky, why do you hate me? Ow! I thought I was out of range of that. I thought I, I thought I successfully dodged, and I clearly did not. Man, I need to get my game together. Money! At least I can afford an upgrade if something goes wrong. I guess I'll just continue on this direction. Oh my... Immediately another crazy boss chamber. Are you serious? Fuck it! I'm about to die anyway. Commit! 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 Ow! Okay, this is where it gets hard. Uh... I don't have much faith in my ability to do this. No. Ah, did not successfully dodge. I tried to dodge the one on the right and walked right into the one on the left. Oh well. I figured I'd go for it since I was already having a bad run and at the very least if I was successful, I could have gotten a new ability. A gay shinobi, a gi giant gay shinobi. Uh, Jesus. Is giant really worth it if you're just a shinobi though? Do I really want to be a giant that's also moving super fast? That sounds like it'd be really hard, actually. Lich Queen Spelunket, Lich Queen Spelunket. I'm not sure what the point of of Lich of the Lich is, to be honest. I looked at their stuff online. It seems like they're basically spellcasters in disguise. Yeah, alright, let's play let's play as a uh, Spelunket again and get more money. Uh, what I was caught off guard by is that apparently the process of upgrading your Spelunket. What am I trying to say? Let's see. I would like to get more uh, bonus uh, hit points when I heal, for sure. That might be worth investing in. Uh, when you... What am I trying to say? Ooh, more hit... Well, that's almost perfect. Let's just fucking get that, I guess. Uh, what I found out is that when you maximum up... If you keep killing people as a lich, you keep getting more hit points. But it actually caps out at 100%. So whatever your, uh... Castle says is your hit point cap... That's how many hit points you stop getting hit points at as a lich. So it's like, I thought that it was a character... Haha! Bouncy items! Screw you guys! What are you gonna do now? Man, my spells suck. That, that, that's something I need to get on upgrading, is just making my spells better. It's really hard to prioritize anything in specific, though. It's just, there's so many things to upgrade that all sound good. Like, hit points is the thing that keeps me alive all the time. I'd like to make more of those happen. Uh, yep, yeah, no, okay. Uh... But yeah, since the hit, since your hit points as a lich actually cap out at 100%, like their like it's kind of misleading. The game tells you like this cl this class has amazing potential, which infers like you can get amazing stats. It's like really what they mean is you can get amazing mana points because you can get a lot. You can get all the way up to 200% mana by uh, getting a bunch of because you can get up to 100% hit out. Get 100% hit points, then turn your hit points into... Yes! Plus two armor! Why can't more of these chests give me stats? I want stats. Do that more. That happens so infrequently that I actually forget it happens at all. I just got chicken. Hup. Careful. A bunch of assholes trying to end my life over here. Of course there'd be projectiles coming at me in both directions. Hup. That mother... Fuck it. Die. There's more behind this guy. Son of a bitch. Get out. Get out. <laughs> I just don't need to deal with these many projectiles in one room. Jesus. Hey, buddy. Die. Can you hit me from there? No, you can't. And now you can't hit anything forever. Because you're dead forever. Assuming that they don't just respawn. For all I know, every time I do this entire castle, it's just the same freaking people over and over again. This is way easier when you're not a giant, because you don't hit your head immediately when you're trying to jump. There's better platforming in general. But yeah, like, as a lich, you get, uh, you get up to 100% hit, hit, uh, hit points, uh, and then you, what you can do is you can use your ability to swap hit points and mana points maximums. So basically, you cut your hit points in half, but that amount of hit points gets applied to your total mana pool instead. Jesus, none of these guys died in one hit. So that, the, the idea there is that you, you, uh, you, you max out your hit points over and over again and keep applying them to your mana, so you have tons of mana. I just realized I, I, I reflexively wipe out those statues. I wipe out those statues the moment I see them, 
to uh, replenish health and mana, even if my health and mana isn't even hurt. Which is a terrible idea. Is that a... I don't know if that's a real chest. I don't trust this game. Ah, oh, it's a fucking Mimic! God damn it. I thought the Mimic would, like, vibrate or something as I was approaching. But it, it, did, it didn't start vibrating until I was, like, right on it. This whole room sucks. I'm out. Really? No fighting? It's a fairy chest, it's a fairy chest room where I'm not allowed to fight. Oh, Jesus! Well, wait. Okay. I guess I'm just in here now. I just... I'll have to commit. No, no likey. No likey at all. No, I'm gonna die now. Fuck! I was right there, too. Damn it, that would have been a good upgrade, too. This game's getting... This game's getting progressively harder. I did not need that to happen. I'm not playing upside down again. No way. That was useless. I immediately was screwed. Uh, Barbarian King. Yeah, why not? Just my, by default, favorite class to play as in this game. Just like... It's just good to have hit points. It makes it easier to deal with things. Gotta double check. Equip load, equip potion... There's no, there's no life drain stat, is there? You ha you have to get li life drain from items, that's what I thought. Okay. Oh well. I only had 600 and... I only had 685 gold? Is that really how bad that went? Wow, okay. Can I even afford, like, the shittiest of things? This game's getting so hard that I actually have difficulty sometimes getting money to buy anything. Wow. That's scary. Okay, uh, that's happening. I was sitting here thinking like, oh, as I'll, as I progress and get stronger in this game, I'll, it'll be even easier to progress, and then I'll be able to wipe out the bosses. I just gotta get to the right level, right? That's what I'm going for? It seemed like the whole game was designed to be like, you're gonna get more and more powerful as you continue to clear it over and over again, and then at the end, you'll be powerful enough to take everything on. And now it seems like the game's just gonna be getting tougher and tougher in response. Although I don't think that, from what I can tell, I don't think the bosses change level. At least I don't. Th I hope they don't. So I, I don't think the bosses necessarily get harder. I think it's just the castle around them scales up on the way. So it's just a matter of that. I need to be. I need to me keep fighting my. They, I guess they just want to keep the fight of me getting to the bosses interesting, and that they must just. They must think that the bosses are just sufficiently hard on their own. Yo, bro, you want to fucking come over here so I can hit you? You're getting stuck on geometry, and it's really problematic, because over there is a freaking eyeball that shoots through walls like a dick. Yo, bro. Bro. Get out of here. <laughs> those freaking panties. They're just the perpetual trap. They make you on... It's one of those many things that puts you on edge all the time when you're playing. Just the idea that, like, stuff around you can just not be real, and will straight up attack you. Oh, when it seems like harmless scenery. Although, of course, when you're playing it as much as I have, at this point... You're pretty trained to look out for every pa no painting as you see it. These, I'm still not trained to use these green platforms though, apparently, because I am useless human garbage. There we go. Careful, I don't want to hit spikes. Okay, we did it. We did it. Yeah. Defeat all enemies. That's not. That's that's the easiest fairy chest, I think, because it's just like, all right, here's do that thing you do all the time. Except this room might be a little hard-ish compared to normal. Ow, dick. Fucking ow. No, there's so many projectiles. Holy shit. I think the blood eye- the eyeballs that shoot blood are like the worst thing just because they have such ridiculous range and shoot straight through objects. Uh, uh, just kill stuff from a range. Wipe it out, bro. Okay. Uh, uh. It's a good thing that- that, uh... It's a good thing these, these don't cost very much. <laughs> Get to spam them a little bit. Is he dead? He's dead. Okay. Man, I should use knives more often. It's actually really really handy. I've got enough mana rege regeneration at this point that it actually works out for me, too. Please give me something cool! It's a vault rune! Is that the double jump rune? Maybe it'll be- maybe it'll be- I don't know- I don't know what, uh... I can't remember what my sword rune is. But maybe... Oh! Okay, I'm short enough. Ow! So many projectiles! Get out of here! Get out of here! Yeah, did you hear though? Oh crap, I thought he was gonna die in one hit. Huh? It's difficult to shoot, to dodge three incoming missiles like that. Oh, hey, 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 chill. There we go. Definitely need to increase my mana damage. I mean, my magic damage, because being able to hit people with knives and stuff like that and it'd be a, an effective method, while also having a bunch of siphon runes to get my mana back, would certainly be quite handy. 
I'm getting enough siphon in various ways of mana regeneration at this point that's actually relatively realistic that I could throw stuff at people. That's probably the secret to me doing successful. Doing successful. Great great job, English man, dude. <laughs> I'm so man I'm so man good to have the English pad, I guess. <laughs> Heal me, motherfuckers! I guess it's not too bad that I uh it's not, a, it's not the worst habit that I break those things reflexively, just because I, I will acknowledge the fact that I don't... I'm really bad at uh, remembering... If I like if I leave them for later, there's a good chance I'll just forget. Or often, sometimes I even get sort of stranded because I run through a really hard room, and then everything past that is also bad. So at some point, I hit, I hit situations where, oh god, he's, he's fucking tracking me, I was trying to jump past him. This is just the worst situation to be in. Okay. Asshole, freaking eyeballs. Get out of here. The worst, it's just the worst that they can shoot through walls because then you don't have a lot of de ways of dealing with them sometimes when you're also dealing with other guys. Get out of here. Just die, Mr. Chain Narrator or whatever. Oh god. Eh. <laughs> just got out of there just barely. This guy's new, right? Ah, oh, crap. I keep healing him. It's very frustrating that you can accidentally just barely leave the screen and revive and heal someone like that, because it's not like they do the courtesy to you. You don't get your hit, po you don't get your mana back that you wasted trying to fight them a second ago. I didn't intentionally, <clears throat> motherfucker. I thought I was getting gonna drop fast enough. You don't. It's like you, you don't always intentionally leave the screen. It's not like always a coward move. Sometimes it's just like you're just trying to dodge attacks and suddenly you're off screen and then everyone gets to heal. It's like, oh well, way to hit me with that. Can the, can the wolf drop through a platform, or is he stuck up there? Because if he's stuck up there, I got this. Oh, I'm sorry, it's a worgen. I'm playing as a worgen in uh, the worlds of Warcraft. And uh, oddly enough, just did the wolf, the werewolf storyline of uh, ah, motherfucker. How did I not test that? Not. Do I not have knockback on this character? Is that what's going on? Oh wait, D D doom traits. You can't knock back anyway, can you? They're just a general- Ah, oh, mother- Everything's bad! Everything's bad! Everything's bad! Get out of here! Jesus Christ. Doom Trits are the worst. Because they just fly around like not giving a fuck. And then they hit you, the shit, the crazy cray cray. What am I trying to say? I'm sorry, I'm rattled. It just- Ah. Uh, nope, I'm out! <laughs> I'm not fighting three guys that throw projectiles while I have 20 hit points. That's not how this place- Ah. <sighs> Is that just a billion spike room? Yes, it is. It's a billion spike room. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right. I can just stand below him because that. I forgot that that's a guy that doesn't. Is that a. Is that a. Okay. Ah, seizure mode. Stress, stress, stress. Okay, what's our. Motherfucker! You're gonna hit me with the. I'm dead. Yep. Uh, my chances of getting out of there alive were nil when he starts shooting. Oh well. Making gradual progress, like always. <laughs> this game's really fucking hard. At least it's always new content, though. I'm not repeating stuff. It's always random, crazy nonsense. Jesus Christ. It's a good thing you're addictive, because I'm angry at you. <laughs>